Hello Scorpio, I'm Susie from The Gift of Two and I'm here to read your cards for this full moon lunar eclipse, which is your moon, I'm a Scorpio moon, um, so, and it's for the week of the 16th of May, so angels, spirit guides in the universe, what would you like Scorpio to know, they, they keep flying out, so there's definitely a message here for you Scorpios. Angels, spirit guides, for Scorpio, please. What would you like Scorpio to know about this full moon eclipse week of the 16th of May? For Scorpio, please. Scorpio. Scorpio, what would you like Scorpio to know about the week of the 16th of May? What would you like Scorpio to know about the week of the 16th of May? Oh, Scorpio, angels, spirit guides. These are powerful cards here. Angels, spirit guides, universe. For Scorpio, please. What would you like Scorpio to know about the week of the 16th of May, please? Scorpio, please. What are the energies for Scorpio? There are lots of cards, but I'll take them. Two. Three. Eight. Okay, Scorpio, we're going to read this. We've got, on the bottom of the deck, we have got the Ten of Cups. This is a marriage, this is a house, this is a family, okay? This is love. There is love surrounding this moment, even though I can't see many cups in this reading. So, there is this union, a divine marriage or something coming, uh, or it's surrounding, this situation surrounds a house or a home. We've got the Emperor with the Devil as your first cards you could have the emperor is an all-seeing powerful businessman aries um warrior like general leader do you know what i mean it's mars it's the leader it's, uh, number four could be significant scorpio but it's the father figure the twin flame the masculine he embodies all the kings and people seem to revere him. Crossing him as the devil. You could be either manipulated or in some kind of toxic um, it could be a Capricorn, it could be Aries Capricorn. As you could be manipulated, being felt feel like you're in some kind of toxic uh, situation, or someone's got an addiction. It could be sex, uh, because we've got the King of Wands up there, who's the passionate. He's also a leader. So there's these two very fiery people. It could be father and son. It could be a granddad and a husband. Uh, but the devil's between these two people. And there's a manipulation going on. So a boss could be manipulating you. A husband, something like that. Father, uh, someone could have a, a, an addiction to drink, drugs, rock and roll. But there's about to be a huge epiphany here with the tower. To these two, are two Aries cards as well. They're very worried, they're very fire, they're very passionate. This is very, very passionate. And this something out of the blue is going to come through and it's going to cause some kind of um, truth to be told. This Queen of Swords is not taking any bullshit. She's open. She's cold to the warmth of relationship. Whatever happens here with this devilish behaviour or this between these two people, these two masculines, um, is making this queen of air very cold uh, and f you probably feel like a pawn in a game uh, there's nothing that it's like I don't want to wait anymore I don't there might not be any talking because someone's just gone cold okay because of this out of the blue situation which could have happened because this devil got involved or someone could be a father was manipulative um between a, a, and, and caused like a, a move of home a loss of home or just something out of the blue something like the washing machine floods and it's like no more i can't take any more 
okay? It's unjust, this is unfair. There's not, I don't feel like I'm being justified in this position. Uh, there's no truth, there's no talking, okay? I'm not waiting around anymore. Actually, someone, there could be a row this week where someone actually does come in, but if they come in, they're gonna say something which terminates a relationship. It's like going back to a relationship you should have ended a long time ago. Um, it's, it puts you at a crossroads. This argument, there's some kind of burning a bridge here where someone is, both people don't win. If they're not talking or they're talking, it doesn't really matter. It puts you at a crossroads because if you talk, there's, there's an argument. So this, something's ended and this magician comes in. You can manifest whatever you want, uh, Scorpio. Pick up a, one of these tools and make it a success because there's an ending of a relationship here. There could be there been an affair, something. I don't know, but this magician seems to be coming in to allow you to choose a different path and wait because there's some kind of hurt in a relationship here where people keep going back together for, for whatever reason, I don't know. Um, we've got the, so there's an end to relationship, causes a drama, just when you think it's safe to go back in the water, something else blows up. Now this could have to do with someone that's jealous and um, this it's a promotion, you get a work promotion, something blows up about work, uh, someone is spying on you at work or jealous and they're gossiping because maybe this ending happens. And they're like, well, why should you get a promotion? It wasn't me, blah, 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 blah. But I think you're just going into this new, you, you might be offered out on a date with the girls, a dinner with the girls. Um, there's some, some kind of, I'm hearing fantastic victory whilst you go out on this date or this celebration. Uh, it allows you, someone could offer you and say come on we're going on holiday are you coming and you're like absolutely after what i've just been through i'm gonna free myself from this overwhelm this worry this uh self-sabotage or this finding out about one person keeping another person uh secret or you know you're just escaping it's there's there's i'm out it's like i'm but it's a victorious i'm out it's not it's not necessarily sad it's like it's it's like someone a team of people or friends show you like a door, like a, 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 a vista or a holiday, or it's like, that's the way out. That's how I'm going to get out. It could even get a new car and just keep driving. <laughs> like, I don't know. It just feels to me that there's it, 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 this situation, whatever it is, whether it's two people or it's husband and wife or it's work or there's some kind of passionate addiction to this or there's um a manipulative uh man, like emperor type figure but even if that emperor is 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 this same king or even if this is a younger person it seems either one of these people is causing this tower moment or this home to be ended or this marriage to be over or this relationship to be over that leaves this woman this queen of swords very cold no bullshit things have been unfair nothing is seems to be going in your favor scorpio you're not waiting around anymore you're going to speak you're going to say you can actually you know and you burn that bridge it allows you to be at a crossroads you might even bring this person back for it to end a second time or a third time and it's like oh but you are offered that you're offered a way out you're offered a new victory you it could be dealing with a cancer um there's someone gossipy around like spreads gossip it could be a child or someone very young uh, it could be something to do with your money to do with your work at the end of this week uh but you're offered a victorious uh way out through this group of women or a marriage or a um a date uh, and you're done with the mental overwhelm. Let's ask the romance angels what you'd like Scorpio to know. Obviously, Scorpio, this might not resonate with it. it doesn't resonate with everybody. Getting to know each other. As you s reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Angels, spirit guides, universe. What would you like Scorpio to know? I don't know. Angels, spirit guides, universe. What would you like Scorpio to know about the week of the 16th of 
say. All right. Trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. Codependency. Addictions. Right. There we go. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. And wedding. This situation involves marriage. Okay. So this sort of row might not be over a third party. It might just be over an addiction that this person has that is ruining things. Uh, it could involve someone being married or it could be your marriage. Uh, oh, what well, you know, I did say it involves this Ten of Cups. There is a divine union, there's a family here. And under that Ten of Cups is the Page of Cups, which you need time out to go and look after yourself. Drink lots of water. You know, I just think this week, Scorpio, angels, there's not enough, enough heart in this situation. It's all about temptation, addiction and... And, and rowing and, you know, escaping and unjustness. Could be just people are moving out, people are changing. Angels, spirit guides, what would you like Scorpio to know about this week? Okay, we've got teaching and learning. Keep an open mind and learn new ideas. Then teach these to ideas to others. Angels, spirit guides, universe, what would you like Scorpio to know about this week of the... 16th of May, the week of the 16th of May for Scorpio, please. Angels, for the week of the 16th of May, this full moon and <laughs> lunar eclipse. Right, so we've got brilliant idea. Yes, your idea is divinely guided. Please take action and bring your idea to fruition. Release and surrender. We shower you with blessings of our radiant love. Open your arms and release the challenges that you've held tightly gripped within your hands. Open your hands and arms and heart to our love and assistance. Take action. You're in touch with your truth in this situation and you need to trust your gut and lovingly assert yourself. The, the emperor would assert himself. He would tell people how it is, regardless. The five of swords is two people asserting themselves quite narcissistically where nobody wins this battle. But maybe this ending needs to happen so that you can have four roads to choose from so that your strength of will will make the next road a success. There's still this ending with tears. It, it dissipates to the three of swords. OK, which is that this. It's like going back with someone, coming back with someone, going back with someone and getting back with someone. And it's like dramas other people's dramas also there could be dramas at work with someone who's jealous but once you get out and have this celebration movement happens it's like swift it's it's someone's rushing towards you or you're rushing away from someone and it's time to untrap yourself from this mental overwhelm where you know you're trapped in something but there's a massive huge gap here which you can just walk straight out of scorpio so it seems like you're going to do that and uh, you're going to take action on something at the end of this week towards maybe a brilliant idea, towards getting to know someone or towards a marriage or towards just uh, releasing a toxic situation or addiction. OK, please like, share and subscribe if it resonates and I will speak to you soon. Bye bye.